Today, we've got a really quick but super cool video, giving an update on two of my previous videos talking about some hidden and cut content from the game The Pathless, as well as an update on the connection between Journey, Abzu, and The Pathless. Links to both previous videos are going to be in the description down below if you haven't seen them yet. Alright, let's get into it. In my previous video, I tried to show how I thought that Journey, Abzu, and The Pathless were all connected in one way or another. This dives into examining easter eggs, similar game concepts like the shared energy, the spirit realm, and other things. If you didn't get a chance to see it, I'll have a link to it at the top of the screen right now. While I have some pretty strong arguments for Abzu and the Pathless being connected, it was always a little more of a stretch connecting Journey and Abzu together. Recently, a comment on that previous video got me to jump back into Abzu to see pretty clear easter egg that links both Abzu and Journey together, or shows that they at least share the same world. I know I'm going to butcher this name, and I'm really sorry about that, but thank you so much to Ahino Barbus Hinoside for pointing this out in the comments. Just a quick warning, some very light spoilers for the last stage of Abzu are ahead. If you jump into Chapter 7 of Abzu, as you progress through the stage, you'll reach a wide open body of arctic water. If you swim to the left and jump onto an iceberg, you can see some penguins, a polar bear, and get a trophy or achievement. Well, that isn't actually the only thing that you'll find when you're here. If you look way off into the distance to the left of this little island, you can actually see between some snowy peaks the exact mountain you are climbing in Journey. I know it's a little hard to see, and I totally missed it when I was playing through myself, but if we line up this image with some of the footage from Journey, you can definitely see that these look basically identical. Pretty cool, right? This means we now have confirmation that Abzu and Journey are in the same world, and pretty much without a doubt then we can link Abzu and the Pathless together, so that should mean that all three really are connected. Now speaking of the Pathless, I posted another video a while back talking about a fifth tall one that was mentioned in the game but never actually in the final version. Links to that video are on the top of the screen right now. While I think it's pretty safe to say we know that the last tall one is the shark from Abzu as you can find it in a secret room after finding all the hidden collectibles in the game, we never got a chance to see it in a corrupted form like all the other tall ones. Or did we? Thanks to another eagle-eyed user over on Giant Squid's Discord, Nimu Rising, we actually did see a fifth corrupted and different tall one in the marketing for the Pathless back before it was actually released. I reached out to Matt Nava on Discord, the creative director and co-founder of Giant Squid Games, and he did confirm that it was indeed another tall one that had been cut from the final version of the game to limit scope. While we did try and reach out again to ask more questions about if he would confirm whether this was indeed Basilla, the fifth tall one, and the shark from Abzu, he unfortunately wouldn't comment saying, there are some mysterious bits in the lore that we prefer not to comment on. While the clip itself is super short and we only get a really really brief glimpse of it, we can see that it does have almost a shark or fish-like design with what looks kind of like gills or scales on the top of its head. Its head is also almost shaped kind of like more like fins or has a hammerhead shark like design as well. So this really makes me believe that this is Basilla, our missing fifth tall one. Alright, that's all I've got for this update, but I thought I'd share these really cool findings with everyone. Let me know in the comments down below what you think or if you found anything else super cool. And as always, happy gaming.